I was had the privilege of going with a great group of people from ECC uh, uh, along with uh, Pastor Kevin to uh, southern India to do a medical dental missions trip. Uh, we went uh, to bless uh, pastors and their wives and families and startup churches and um, other groups including um, uh, leper colonies. They were living in um, buildings that were abandoned and uh, old government buildings and whatnot and uh, some of them didn't have doors and windows. If that's not bad enough, these people were uh, disfigured from the disease and a lot of them were missing um, appendages, toes, uh, feet, legs. I asked him to let me see people as he sees them. You know, through, I want to see people through his eyes. And so um, that first night, we, our format was we would uh, worship as a group and sing songs and then one of the pastors would teach and then we would um, pray and then we would feed them and, um, and then we would have our medical dental camp. There was about, there were about 30 or 40 people there and there was a woman in the front row, near the front row, and uh, I could not take my eyes off of her. She was tall and um, she, her hair was just kind of brittle looking and dry looking. She had sunken in eyes and she was worshiping and she seemed happy. And uh, the thing is, she was uh, missing all her fingers. So she was just putting her hands together you know, with no fingers. Uh, anyway, we left and then that night, um, in the middle of the night, like two in the morning, I had a dream. In the dream, I knew I was in heaven. And, uh, and there, I, I looked up and there was a, a woman approaching me, this beautiful, strikingly beautiful woman with beautiful dark black shiny hair and uh, beautiful dark brown eyes, beautiful smile. Uh, it was this woman and uh, somehow in the dream I knew it was this woman and she was thanking me and thanking me and thanking me and thanking me for coming. The whole rest of the trip um, I, I didn't see these people the same anymore. We still went to all kinds of leper colonies. I didn't look at how they looked anymore. I just saw through them and I think it was this dream. I think God just showed me how he sees people and as a result, I, uh, I could love them with a Christ-like love. You know, I would, I would uh, encourage anyone who, who uh, has uh, um, someone that they're trying to love uh, just ask the Lord to show them how He sees them because it's life-changing.